It's a nine and a half acre campus in Cleveland with a couple of schools and buildings that date back to the mid 1900s. I really look forward to this summer. Carolyn Gay calls this place home. Got a very nice basement. I've been redecorating that myself. <laughs> a nonprofit, Fairhill Partners, owns the property. Carolyn lives at a townhouse here, raising her three grandsons. Active boys, okay? And when I say active, they need this space here. She's part of what's called a kinship family. According to Fairhill Partners, it's a blood relative 55 or older raising kids when their own parents are no longer in the picture. It seemed like the right place for myself and my children. And Fairhill wants more kinship families to move into the village. So the plan is to bring these old brick buildings back to life and turn them into apartments, safe homes, a lot different than living in the inner city. And try to find uh, accommodation to rent these days. It's not easy to find it in uh, areas and districts that are uh, quite as secure as you might like. Associate Director Michael Gathercole stresses there's a big need for this project. There are 12,000 uh, kinship families in Cuyahoga County alone, and the number is growing. The first phase of renovations will begin soon. This building will eventually house nine apartments, and the goal is to keep going. Carolyn Gay can't wait to have new neighbors. I'm happy to be here. Um, what more can I say? In Cleveland, Kristen Byrne, News Channel 5.